Hi, I'm Benjamin Chilcott, and uh, I guess it's no surprise uh, to hear that I have a lot of success with chicks. And uh, today I'd like to share some of that experience with you. Um, first thing to say, obviously, is uh, you have to grow yourself a lot of big bushy facial hair. Chicks dig a mo, big hairy mo, makes you feel like a man, look like a man, and they just love it. As an example, though, uh, of, of how to deal with chicks on a more kind of one-to-one uh, -one basis, I have a few uh, examples of uh, email dialogue that I've had uh, with some chicks in the agency, which uh, I thought might be of uh, interest. The first, and I uh, I've decided, of course, to try and keep uh, girls' names uh, anonymous. <laughs> they know who they are, and I know who they are. So, Joe. I really, really loved working on the environmental project with you. How about we go out the back for a little slap and tickle? Uh-huh. She's come back saying, you make me sick. Yep. That's that whole butterflies in the tummy thing that girls get when they like a real man. Butterflies make a sick poor girl. Never mind. Majuli. Oh yeah? Fancy a bit of what I've got, babe. That's what I said. And she said, I don't think I'd ever get over it probably never recover. What can I say? Chicks don't get over me, babe. And then the last one, Avers. I'll just call it Avers rather than Avril, which is her real name, so you, you don't get it. Um, you, me, babe, how about it? And she's come back and said, fuck off, slugface, which I guess is more ambiguous than the others, but I, I'm pretty sure there's, uh, there's something in there for everyone. Anyway, that's your tips for now, boys.